I'm John Volker, Senior Editor from High Gear Media, and this is our two-minute review of the 2011 Chevrolet Cruze Eco, the most economical compact that Chevrolet sells. We're here in New York City at the end of a 250-mile road test in which we wanted to see whether or not we could get from the Cruze Eco what the EPA rates it at, which is 28 miles a gallon city, but 42 miles a gallon highway with the six-speed manual transmission. We got 34.2 miles a gallon. That's about right. It's close to the, the combined rating that the EPA gives you, and that's a significant advance over the Cobalt, which is the predecessor to the Cruze. Now, the Cruze is a world car. They sell this car in dozens of countries all over the world in many, many different versions. This is its first model year in North America. It comes with the latest safety features, including 10 airbags, which is quite a lot for a compact car. Uh, OnStar is standard, and a number of other features. But in terms of the fuel economy, the thing to remember about this one is that it's a six-speed manual. And manual transmissions, having to shift for yourself, are less than 10% of all the cars sold in North America. So you'll get that high highway mileage, but you have to shift for yourself. And the way the car does that is really by having what we call over-geared top gears, fifth and sixth. The engine turns very, very slowly in those gears, which is great for fuel economy when you're on a level road. However, if you're on an uphill or you suddenly need to pass, you have to downshift, maybe not once, but twice, in order to get the engine up into its power. Still in all, it's a relaxing car to travel in, and it lives up to its name, the Chevy Cruze.